Okay, what I've got here is a soda bottle preform. I've also got a lid to go with it. Now what this is, before they turn a soda bottle into a, uh, before they turn this into a soda bottle, what they'll do is they'll make this and then they'll heat it up and blow it out into a soda bottle shape. So this is actually just a soda bottle that hasn't been expanded out into a soda bottle. See the lid's even got the little things on it still. So, I've also got something else here. You guys are familiar with this, right? Of course you are. I also happen to have coconut oil. Let's see if we can fill this up. Then this is going to be awkward to hold. This is probably going to freeze my hand, but that's alright. It's not as easy as it looks. That is isobutane and liquid state. See, it's pretty cold. I think it's settled now. See the frost on the edge there? Let's see if it can dissolve. Well, before all our stuff goes away, let's seal it up. I think that's sealed pretty well. Doesn't I don't see much bubbling anymore. Of course it's going to have to warm up. I can't tell if it's dissolving or not, it's the only problem. Maybe I should have put a crayon in there. Coconut oil is basically just like a low temperature wax. And wax is basically just a high temperature oil. And butane is basically just a low temperature oil, so they're about the same. They're all hydrocarbons after all. Maybe some duct tape will fix it. I don't know if you can see that or not, but on the camera you can actually see the little diffusion lines of the coconut oil. It is dissolving. I don't expect it all to dissolve. I've tested this with the crayon and it actually colors the butane a different color when it dissolves into it. It's pretty neat. I don't know if you can see those diffraction lines or not. The density difference from the coconut oil is a lot more dense than the butane. It actually has gotten a lot smaller amount though, as you can see. Quite a bit has dissolved already. I wonder if the entirety will dissolve. Only one way to find out. Oh, that was neat. Bubbles. Normally butane can't support bubbles like that. It doesn't have the surface tension to. It must be the coconut oil changing the properties of the butane. this. I don't know why, but that, it's been over a year since that thing was sealed with butane in it. The liquid level is still exactly the same as where it was before. I'm not exactly sure what... I, I think this was some kind of cologne bottle or something. 
the rubber band's just around there just to make sure that nobody unscrews the lid or anything. I'm gonna see how long this actually lasts. So far it's done a year. It's pretty good.